Hey guys, welcome back. This is another Android Nougat tips and trick. And one of my video I did post it earlier that uh, I was not able to figure out how did my navigation bar of the Nexus 6 turn into transparent, which was not there on all the Nexus and Pixel phones. But I did figure out that actually that was a fault of an application. So the app uh, we are talking about is called the Two Tile for Nougat. So I did uninstall that app, and but uh, still uh, this app was not able to revert back the effect that it has done on my phone. So we'll talk about this here. So what does uh, this app does? So once you install that app, you're not going to get any open button and you're not able to see that on this app drop. So you have to go to this here, click notifications. And once you install that, you're going to get this here, click edit button. And you're going to get this here, do tall for nugget. You are going to get some, some things here like power button, ambient display turn on and off and some like immersive mode. So just giving you guys a demo, I just kept here this thing here. So it's not going to give much option, but whatever it is giving is pretty important. This is power button. If you just click here, so you're going to get this thing here. You're not have to press your uh, in the power button here. You are going to get this option. You have an important point. Your device has to be rooted. All right. So we already seen this here power button option scheme. So that is a feature and uh, important point here. This is called immersive mode that we are talking about. So once you click here, you can see it's going to give you four mode. The first row that you're seeing is for the status bar and this is navigation bar. So it has four kind of, you know, status navigation bar. First combination is default. Both are there. Second is uh, your navigation bar is visible, but status bar is transparent. Third is status bar, navigation bar gone. And fourth is both. So I'm going to take example of first here. So once you selected that, you can see status bar is gone. And this is like if you have used the Cyanogen mod 14.1 I already have shown you. They have this expand desktop feature built in, in the system, but and right uh, this nexus force doesn't come with this stuff here so you can see if we just slide it on you're going to see that so i'm really sure like no nobody wants to watch time each time like how much is time and things once you come to your desktop you're going to see this anyway so you can see this is pretty nice uh, you have some bigger display even that works on the app levels too you can see you got the bigger space here you can easily play youtube on big size and font so that's very important so now going to the another feature this is uh, when you can make your status bar transparent and and sorry this navigation bar transparent and status bar is here you can see it is gone once you slide up it will come and also it is going to be visible on uh, not visible on the places you can see on the play store you got uh, some bigger space so that's actually nice so you can do that now let's try the last option Immersive mode, uh, click here. So both things are gone. Status bar gone, navigation bar gone. So once you open the setting, you can see you got a bigger space, but you have an annoying thing you need to each time slide it down to come. And yeah, guys, you can see there is a pixel animation that you can do that. Also, there is a separate video. You can get this, uh, you know, pixel navigation bar on any of the Nexus 6P and the 5X. Not on the Nexus 6, only two devices are as of now the zip file is available. So I'll put this video links in below. So now you can easily revert back and click on immersive mode again. So depends on your preferences. I prefer to use navigation bar with no status bar because I really don't need for the status bar. You can see it's pretty much gone. So there you have it guys. A quick tip for your Android uh, Nougat devices. So that works on 7.1.1 beta w 2 and it will work on the official Android Nougat 7.12. But make sure your device has to be rooted. So follow the videos, there's no such panic at all. It's a pretty simple step. So I hope you guys find this video helpful. This is Sarah. I'll catch you next video. Have a great day.